of the members face and i am ash and today we are at quesalito and we will be answering your questions while eating all of this delicious food yes pero before all that what's this place ba ate ash quesalito so it's a mexican restaurant it's near usd mm -hmm. so literally you can see right over there usd um, I think that it's gonna be a popular place once face to face class starts. So, true. Na, na mahilig kumain and na miss na yung mga galaan, di ba? Yes. So, yeah. Actually, right now na ano na. na. Oh, nga. Yeah. Come in, you're sa food na nasarapan mga yan. Yeah, kinda sa nachos. And I guess this one. Okay. Yeah. Although this one, nagulat ako nung, nung first time gumaba dito. No, nung nilagay dito. Uh -huh. I was like, oh, it's a burrito. It's a burrito. Yeah, it's a burrito. So these are like very famous uh, Mexican staples. So we have nachos, um, quesadillas, nachos again. Yes. Uh, burrito and fajitas. Yes. So aside from that, they also have like uh, chicken wings with different sauces. So. Only wings, but dito? Yeah. I, oh. I think they have only wings aside oh from like a lot of pieces of chicken. Today, Again, we are going to answer your questions while eating, so let's start! Yeah! Bye. So first question is, how do you write songs? Okay, uh, okay sige, go! Okay, I'm going We write songs by ano first ba? listening to like the, the melody. Yeah, the... I'm going to try it when song mismo. I ko muna siya marinig. Tas mag-isip ako ng lyrics that would fit yung timing. And then ayun. As for theme, uh depends kasi on what kind of song we're going for. So harder kasi more on encouraging yung song kaya mm -hmm. ganun yung naging theme niya. Yeah. Nam, um, yeah. Yan. Sorry, naka-focus sa ang sarap ng food. Ang sarap ng ano, ng sauce. No, <laughs> para siyang yung pag sa Big Mac. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a combination between sweet and salty, and I really like that about a lot of foods. So, yeah, a chicken puff no cheese that's like burnt. Yeah. So nice. I guess sa pag-write ng songs, hindi naman ako masyado naiiba. Hindi ako masyado naiiba kay Ate Ash kasi yeah, we work together in yeah. sa Polar. So we like help each other if ever may need na to fix the lyrics or may merong hindi like pumasa kung baga pag pinapa check or like sa sa samin dalawa na lang din yeah yeah and it was a process lalo sa first song yeah kasi I, first time talaga na magwrite ng lyrics yeah and I guess kinakapadin natin like working with new people mm. yeah next question musical influences so Hello. yun feeling ko madami to yeah yeah kung sa polar I guess ang Musical influence namin is Ed Sheeran, di ba? Mm -hmm. And acoustics. Oh, yun. Um, actually, yung first song was uh, more on Ed Sheeran and I'm Young. Kung familiar mm -hmm. kayo dun, oh, right, right. artist na yun. Yeah. I'm yeah. Young. Actually, di ba nag-record din tayo ng parang... Yeah, Marigold. We, we covered Marigold para ma-check nyo yung voices namin. New kung, range. Ano, vibe check. Mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> Pero kung personal musical... Uh, influences. Mm -hmm. Siyempre, iba. Uh -huh. Kasi, um, iba yung music na pinapakinggan namin usually. So, ako, I think, I put down Generations from Excel Tribe as a huge influence for me because I really like danceable music. Um, Naalala ko yung mga MV na napapanood natin sa mga so Japan? Uh -huh. To Japan and then dito na din no napapanood na din na nandito sa Pilipinas. Yun, okay. they're, they're very cool. Yeah. yeah. Sa akin naman, uh, I think my musical influences are varied kasi una si Ariana Grande, mm -hmm. tapos pangalawa ko siguro K-pop mm -hmm. and then siguro a, a little bit of Japanese. Yeah. Yeah, kasi of course doon din tayo nag-start din, yeah, yeah, yeah. 'di ba, as an artist. Ah, may so, nang gusto ng i-add sa uh, akin. Yeah. Recently lang na-add. Recently ko lang siya na-add uh -huh. sa like musical influences. Pero like, um, kung kilala niyo yung streamer na si Lily Pichu, ah! she also does music kasi. And the True. music that she does is like, 
parang nakakarelate ako sa music niya. Ang cute kaya ng mga music. Kapag cop, it's cute but kind of depressing at the same time. Ah, really? Yeah. Hindi, hindi ko naiintindihan pa yung kaya, hindi ko iniintindi pa. Kaya, yun. I, I like her music a lot. I guess to add then, I guess yung sa ating dalawa, hmm? na musical influences is KDA. Oh, yeah. Yeah. KDA and on, on some other K-pop artists. Mm -hmm. Ako, I really like it. See? When and why did who? Oh. Huh? When and why did you start? Did you start this, this project? project? Well, at first, it wasn't like I guess supposed to be like a group, I wanna try a this. duo. Okay, try me. Ako ni ko na Yes. Show, show, show. Pwede ba? Pwede ko pong hawakan. Yeah. Yuhu! It is time to eat, my friends. Yes. Yan. Yan. I guess, ano, yung with regards to how Polar started, hindi siya, hindi siya duo, kumbaga, like, parang, dapat solo. Yeah. It was supposed to be a solo project. Yeah. Sa akin. Yeah. And then, sabi ko, di ko kaya mag-isa. Sinama ko si Faith. So, <laughs> and then I thought it was just one song. Akala ko isang kanta lang. <laughs> Tapos, ayun, nagkaroon pala ng parang, ano, ayun, it, it developed into what Polar is right now. Uh, yun, yun siya. Mm. Yeah. Biggest challenge you face as a duo during this pandemic? I guess, it's not having events. Yeah. It's the biggest problem for any artist right now. Yeah. Kasi, recording, pa natin gawin ng paraan, MV, mm. nagawa natin ng paraan. Mm -hmm. Pero, events, we can't. Mm -hmm. We literally cannot. <laughs> so, I think that really held us back from like the stuff that we really like to do, which is performing, because we can't perform in front of the people that actually appreciate us. Yeah. So, I think a lot of artists share that. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's online events, but it's. It's different. Yeah, eh. iba pa rin yung nakikita face to face. Kung baga sa online classes din, di ba? Yeah. <laughs> iba pa rin yung can't relate, didn't go through that. <laughs> okay. Okay, next question. What differentiates an artist from an idol? Ooh, spicy. I guess what differentiates an artist from an idol is that more more on binibig kasi nung idol, more on binibigay sa amin. Oh, yung kung ano yung kailangan namin gawin. Tapos, sa artist, you have like creative freedom. Hmm. And you are able to share then your... Opinion. Yeah, your opinion about what you put out in the public. So, kasi, I guess, yung sa idol kasi, it's more on that, that characteristic, di ba? Hmm. Yung characteristic na, na binigay sa'yo. There's sa a yung. certain stereotype for mm -mm. idols kasi na you have to always be positive or whatever. Yeah. You know, there's that. Pero kasi kapag artist, more on you're free to be yourself. Mm -hmm. no, actually, in 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 encourage kami na yung magpost kahit even if we have a bad day. Okay lang sabihin na we had a bad day. Mm -hmm. Wherein kapag idol ka, kailang mo itago yun. Mm -hmm. So I think isa yun sa biggest difference. Yeah, you have to keep up with your image. Wala well, kung baka. Ngayon. Traits that you like about each other. Hmm. I guess. Si Ate, si Ate si kasi G siya sa mga ano, ginagawa namin. Nakikita niyo naman, like, a lot of our activities lagi magkakasama, di ba? Hmm. And kahit, kahit tayo si Ate Ash, kahit introvert siya, tapos ako extrovert, sobrang polar opposite. <laughs> polar! Stan polar char. Ano? Kahit polar opposite kami, Nagji pa rin kami sa mga trip ng isa't isa. Mm. Kung baga nagkiklik yung mga gusto namin. And yeah. I really like that about Ate Ash. And yeah, parang ate talaga siya. Kasi, minsan, <laughs> ang kulit ko eh. Totoo. I mean, what I like about Faith naman is, well, yun din. The fact that you're an extrovert. Mm. So, kung ano man kulang sa akin, <laughs> ano ka? <laughs> kung kulang ako sa energy, ay ayan. Kung... He also helps me like sa singing kasi mm. yun yung doon ako nahirapan. So, Ay! Sa so dancing naman si Ate Ash sa akin. Uh, mm. Alam niya kagad yung mga steps. Pero wala pa kaming dance sa polar dog. 
Oh nga. Sadly. So, when In the kaya? future. Sana. Hopefully. Kapigyan nyo na ako, please. 